today I am playing hair roulette. I don't know if that makes any sense to you. I'm basically letting my hairstylist do whatever she wants to my hair. Like literally whatever. I had texted her and I was like, hey girl, I'm bored. Do you want to have some fun? She said, yeah, what do you want to do? And I said, no, what do you want to do? Like, what do you want to do? Like, you have the power to do whatever you want to my hair. I don't care. You could give me blonde. You could give me copper. You could give me brown. Whatever it is. I'm going to try to find a cute little outfit. Maybe like a two-piece set or something comfortable but also cute. I'm on my way to my hair appointment. This is what my hair is looking like. My makeup came out pretty cute. I do have some breakouts, but it's not that bad. I'm really excited for my new hair. I wonder what she's going to give me. I'm going to try my best to vlog everything. This is my little outfit. But I'll see you guys. Just got here. I'm about to walk in. I'm super excited. Walking in, I go to Hasa Balan in Covina. My hairstylist is Sarah. She is amazing. I'm going to tag her down below so you guys can check her out. Hasa Balan is actually the salon I went to when I first touched my hair. The first time I ever touched my hair was when I went blonde, okay? Shout out Lemma. She is the owner of Hasa Balan and she's the one that gave me my blonde. In, I think 2020 uh, we took before pictures we were looking cute but I couldn't wait to see what character we were gonna unlock this day look at me I was looking so happy so this is Candace next to Sarah she is her assistant I'm gonna tag her down below as well she is awesome so I don't know too much about hair okay I'm not a hairstylist but from what I know from what I heard from what she explained to me we were gonna do a color removal because I had black hair for two years so we need to get all that dark out of my hair so we can go light and right here I was like what is she gonna give me like I don't even know what we're gonna do I was like is she gonna give me blonde but I'm like no I don't think so like she's gonna probably give me like a copper My camera had actually died so i recorded the rest of the appointment with my phone look at this i was like oh my god like what is going on we slapped on the color and i'm like okay we're probably gonna be copper because of the color i don't know much about the color theory for hairstylists on how to get a certain color but right here i'm like she's already blowing it out oh my god this is looking so cute it looks like a dark copper i'm loving it sarah gives the best blowouts the best haircuts i definitely recommend her so i love to do long layers i used to do very very short layers but i've been loving the longer layers like i said she gives the best blowouts i actually learned a lot of my hair technique tricks and tips from her and i just noted how she does my hair and that's kind of how i do it too it's looking like a very true brown these are the after pictures i don't want to get copyrighted but i did this little transition it's the you know i'm sexy don't call just text me bitch so can get on my speed and then that's the reveal of the true brown this is right out of the salon this is when i got home one week later today i'm gonna bleach my eyebrows girl because my eyebrows are very black like this is a bleaching cream and so basically i could just leave this on my eyebrows for a few minutes and they'll lighten up a little bit and i honestly wanted to do this when i was copper but i kind of just like forgot about it because i was only copper for like two months it's time and if i don't like it i could just fill them in or i can dye them with some beard dye it's light and stark hair okay this also has um aloe vera so it's good for sensitive skin bitch my skin is super sensitive also i am breaking out horrendously like look i'm pretty sure i know why i'm breaking out my hormones are fucked up right now i'm gonna try my best to do this cute do this nicely okay so i know this comes with instructions like it comes with like a little cup this is what it comes with sorry it is yeah this is what it looks like i'm gonna have to mix all of these things up into like a little mixture like this measure one accelerator cap full of powder and add it to the mixing cup Ooh. okay i'm gonna add a cup full a cap full sorry this is a cap full Maybe this. You wanna go outside, baby? Bye. Bye. I'll see you later. Here's a cap full of the accelerator, and I'm gonna add it like this. Let's try a little bit more of this powder thing, the accelerator. 
Bitch ass dogs. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave it like that. I kind of want to like go back and forth because I have black eyebrows. Like my eyebrows are pitch black. Okay, I'm gonna leave it like this um, for 10 minutes. It's 2.56. Oh my God, it's kind of burning. It's kind of burning. Um, I'm gonna take it off at 3.05, just in case. Okay, I'm kind of excited. Oh my god, I wonder what it's gonna look like. Okay, it's 306. I got my headband ready. Okay. And this is to remove it with the spatula. What if I didn't even do it right? Why does it still look black? Or did they lighten up a bit? I can't tell. Oh my god! It's brown! Okay, this looks cute. I feel like it matches my hair a lot more. Um, this is cute. I feel like it's not much of a difference, but I could kind of see the lightness in my hair. Oh yeah, I feel like you could see it here a lot better. Oh my god, I make it look like shit. But look, they're a little bit lighter. Should I go for another round? Yeah, I like it. Maybe if my makeup was cuter, I feel like it'd be better. I think I'm gonna reapply it and make them a little more lighter. Just a little bit, okay? Literally just a little bit more lighter. But I already like the tone. I hope I'm not being impulsive. But this is actually really cute. Like, it's adorable. I really like my hair, but what was throwing me off was the dark eyebrows. And I was like, you know what? I feel like I should do this because when I was copper, I really wanted to do this. But I kind of backed out because I was like, I'm not going to be copper for that long. I'm going to go I'm gonna go back to black in like a few weeks. So that's why I never did it. But I feel like if I would have done this when I was copper, it would have been such a slay. Oh, yeah. I think this is cute. This is actually really cute. lighter but like it's like a really really pretty tone oh 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 okay i feel like this matches my hair a lot better it looks so freaking cute these are the eyebrows now they are adorable i'm gonna come back actually you know what i'm gonna do my hair and do my makeup all over again because this looks like shit okay and i want to see how this will actually look Hello, my eyebrows came out so good. Don't mind my lips, I'm gonna retouch them right now. I know they look like, they literally look like I ate ass. My eyebrows look a lot softer, like look at them. I only kind of outlined them, so. Okay, let me just give you guys a close up. Look at how beautiful and soft they look. So before, I feel like they were just so hard to work with. Why are we both Loki twinning? We're brown. I'm gonna do my hair. Here is the left side of my hair. I already did it. And now I'm gonna do the right side. And you're gonna wanna go, you're gonna wanna put this all over your hair. Just like this. You can even, like, <coughs> sorry, I always like a new cock sneeze when I smell it. This is the hair. I feel like it looks so voluminous. What do you guys think about my hair? I feel like my hair is low-key a sleigh. You can't really see the color that good. Oh, I feel like if I'm like up close, you can see it. It's like a reddish tone. I think it's so beautiful. And now that I have lightened my eyebrows, I feel like, girl, I give like soft girl. You know, I feel like with my black hair and my black eyebrows, I was giving like black cat you see it looks like reddish like a true brown i think it looks so cutesy and then these are my eyebrows now i did shade them in a little darker because they're super like red but i feel like this gets very soft girl i'm obsessed So this is my hair. Oh my god, it looks so pretty. Let me know what you guys think about my hair and my eyebrows. I hope you guys love my hair. I hope you guys love my eyebrows. I think they're so pretty. 
but yeah and i feel like girl i need to figure out what colors match my hair now i realized i never filmed an outro but this is what my hair is looking like so my hair did fade after a few washes but i am feeling super feminine i feel so beautiful for the summer like just the light hair the light eyebrows like look at me here i just i just feel so feminine and i love it i think this is the best decision i've ever made for myself i'm definitely gonna love this era like it faded into more of a copper brown but i truly am obsessed with it like look at the little updos i've been doing i don't know i've been going out i've been getting dressed up i definitely feel like a new version of myself but yeah make sure to like comment and subscribe let me know what y'all think about my new hair <laughs>